Can you tell us some stories about some of the DJ, some of the Hurt Jams? Oh, the jams were crazy because I went to a jam and uh, Sasa was there along with Trixie. And uh, Trixie uh, was one of, the, one, of the, one of the most talked about dancers along with Sasa. But the first B-Boys. Yes, the, the number one A-Boy and B-Boy was Sasa though because no. Trixie started doing moves and he took out a fake dildo and started dancing <laughs> around doing the Charlie Chaplin like move and then um Sasa spun around and doing these glasses with, with the mustache and turned back around and had some scissors and he cut the fake dildo off and everybody went crazy in the party. Oh <laughs> and I was like, wow, that was and Sasa had these like rubber band leg moves that was just unbelievable the way he he make his legs wiggle and he like go almost go close to the ground and still spring back up. But uh, every time he had a a, a her cat event, he would tell he said mm -hmm. he wouldn't even say b boys. He and he wouldn't say uh um uh, the word for them dancing was called going off when it was time to go off. That's what her could say. He wouldn't say B boys, come on. He'd be like, "It's time to go off," and he would put on a a a, a record, a, a break beat that everybody started getting noticed. All 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 B boys would kind of notice when they hear that beat. No matter what it is, when they hear all the drums or the horns, they would start getting ready to get to the floor and clear everybody, clear space for them, and they just do their thing and go off and that was amazing you know and phase was one of them he he would do the up rock and he had these things like he could do a kick up like like you know like a karate guy you fall on your back you just throw your body up and land on your feet and spin it was a lot of guys that did a lot of amazing dance steps so uh uh contrary to what a lot of people want to believe and not to be uh, uh, splitting people up, but I know most people say. didn't go to uh, hip hop parties. It was mainly a black thing, and not to be saying that we uh, they didn't learn it, but they didn't come to the early parties. They got in, started getting into it later. But in the beginning, it was all us. You know, just like we're writing, they were there, but the best writers were all brothers. No disrespect and no trying to say, you know, and the best writers came from the Bronx. So, uh, you know, me, Butch Two, uh, Tracy, 